What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to the episode of Fisher Me, D Ying. I am so excited to be out here this morning. It is good to be back on the camera. I know it's been like a week or so. I am out here crappie fishing, but for this daylight, I'm actually gonna target walleye, okay? It is a great place to fish for walleyes, uh, crappies, bluegills, panfish, like perch and stuff like that. It is a great fishery. I'm out here looking for these fish. I'm not a crappie professional, I'm not a walleye professional, but I'm out here throwing moving baits and getting into some crappie jigs, all right? Woo! And it's cold out, it's about 30 degrees, but it's gonna warm up and hopefully we catch some walleyes. I don't know how it's gonna go, I don't know what we're gonna do today. I actually never been here before and hopefully we run into some nice fish. So stay tuned, hit that subscribe button, and hopefully I can put you guys on some nice bite. You guys are awesome. Fish on you guys, let's go. All right guys, again, like I said, I'm actually gonna start off more on the walleye bite. I'm gonna grind that out for a little bit. I know crappie's fun too, but I just got one middle floating around, you know, just in case there is some big crappies hanging around here. But like I said, main focus is going to be this way. Okay. Main focus is going to be walleye, okay? We need some walleyes in our life, all right? All right, let's check up on the, this guy. Yeah, they probably don't like this dead minnow anyways. So, let's just, uh, <laughs> dead minnow's real dead. It's like messed up dead. Right by the head here, y'all. Cause they're eating these minnows head first. And I'm using a super thin wire hook. Come on, got to hook it by the skin, just like that. That way when they eat it head first, man, it's on. It's on, boys. Boom, just like that. We'll just watch our bobber as we fish for walleye. So I'm just gonna look for these walleyes for these this first like hour or two, and then um, after that, I'll probably just focus on crappies, y'all. All right, switch it up, put on the green grub. I'm not really digging this uh, ripple shad, anyways. It's a cool color, it's just I don't know. Kind of want something green. Green is good. Where my green stuff at? There it is. Super tiny green grub. Let's see what's up. Oh, Bobber's down, Bobber's down. Got him. Oh yeah, baby. Ooh, nice crappie. Oh no, it's kind of small though. Should I keep him? Nah. Well, he does have a nice back. I'm not gonna lie, he has a real nice back. You got a nice back, dude. A nice back. He's pretty small, I'm probably just gonna let him go. See ya, dude. Oh my gosh. Jeez, chill. Oh, catfish. Jeez. Hammer my grub here. You all right, buddy? Dang, got you real good. All right, ooh, chill. In this way. Hmm. Gives me an idea, you know. Got some, I got some. Oh, walleye, let's go. But he's too small. Dang. Well, there you go, you guys. Got the walleye. Catch your release. Oh, what you got there? You need a net? Let me help you. Yeah, it looks like a pike. Oh, yeah, it's a staying pike. Here, let me help you. Let me help you. Don't, don't break your lure. I got you. I'll grab him by the neck. Mm hmm. You go, you go, you go, you go. Just let him do his thing. I got you. Chill, buddy, chill. Oh, bring it back over here. Over here, boy. <laughs> I got it, I got it. Oh, 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 he came off. Yeah, I didn't even touch him. He broke off. 
Just a northern. Oh, there we go. I finally got one. Oh, and it's a giant perch. Oh my god. <laughs> it's a giant perch, you guys. Oh, jeez. That's a big perch. <laughs> Look at that, you guys. That is insane. <clears throat> All right, let's get him in a bucket. Found the juice. Big old perch. Like, like 10 inches. Yeah. Got him. We'll keep. Some slabs in there now. Yeah, slabs. And we're on. We're on. Oh yeah, little guys. Chill, chill, chill. I'm gonna let you go. I'm let you go. Go, oh, get back my lure. Okay. Oh, nice perch. <laughs> yeah, let's go. <laughs> Big old perch. Woohoo. Yeah, it's a 10 inch perch. I caught some 10 inch perch. Huge. Oh, man. Yeah, it's a slow bite. I was here all morning. They just started turning up. A two 10 inch perch, man. Yeah, well, this one's just, yeah, this one's just sitting there. This one was in there for at least a good 30 minutes and you finally picked it up. I'm just rigging it up at the back here. Just like that. Jeez. Oh yeah, man, just, they really like this green and gold thingy or whatever. Oh man, I got so excited with those two perch. Clutch, man. Oh, I got a fish. Oh, got a slap, got a slap. Oh, he's coming back. Yeah. Coming back with the real deal now. <laughs> oh, man, I'm in a lot of trouble. Oh, man, I'm in a lot of trouble now. He got his perch stuff coming. <laughs> Little guy. They're coming back, though. It's good. So you catch back to back. There we go. All right, this one's a little bigger. Yeah. Should I keep him, guys? Should I keep him? Nah. He has a nice back, though. All right, well, let me just show y'all real quick of what we got going on here. We got a... Uh, Big old perch, yo. Like, these things are massive. Easily 10 inch. Check it out. Got a rule right here. It's easily 10 inch. 11 inch, baby. Look at that. 11 inch perch. 
if you stay still and start curling up. 11 inch perch y'all. Easily. That's insane. And he's kind of curled up too. We got that one. We got another one here. We got some crappies. I'm throwing back a couple because they're too small that I don't want them. But uh, we got about like six fish in here. Let's keep going at it. Just throwing out bobbers. And guys next to me is throwing bobbers and minnows. We're catching them, but it's hard to get the big ones. So let's keep going at it. Oh, I'm on. That's a nice one. Yeah, still too small. They just look big in the water. I think I found the juice during this current here. There's a little current underneath. There we go. Little guy, going back. They have a nice shoulder to them, you know? But, yeah. Too small. Again, you guys, I'm using goat minnow. Nothing crazy, nothing fancy. All right, y'all know I'm all about simplicity. Goat minnow and a green jig head, that's it. Money shot. And it's not necessarily like obvious bobber pull you know this where you just gotta watch your bobber if it stops floating it's like there's a fish on your, your bait already so right now bobber's going this way right if it's just like obviously stops like that see there's a fish on it this guy's so tiny now this is a keeper yo no i'm kidding but yeah that's that's what it is it's not a bobber pull it's just a different kind of drift you know Try it again, right in here. It's time for a new goat. Again, right now, Bobber's still drifted over here a little bit. Pulls the, if it pulls the opposite way, there's a fish on it. Or if it stops the Bobber from floating. Again, y'all, just watch the Bobber. Bite is so finicky, it's crazy. It's not a summer bobber bite. There we are. See, just like that. Bobber stopped floating, fish is on. Little guy. Yeah, we're on, boys. That's a nice one. We'll keep this one right here. Uh, I don't know, man. It's all right. He has a really bulky back. I don't know. Nah, we'll let him go. Man, find this big one. figure them out just gotta figure out the big ones <laughs> you know that's the hard part gotta locate them I don't know where they're at oh this one's oh this one's decent yeah it's better they all might look the same but no this one's actually a lot better yeah this one's oh, oh. yeah this one's decent still right there Really bulky, and he hit it real hard too, so. You deserve to be kept, buddy. There we go. Oh man, we pull on them, all right? Yeah, these, these are actually pretty decent. They're not bad. I'll just keep two, just like this. Just, just in case. That's a nice one. Yeah, it's all right. It's skinny.
Man, I'm in no luck, man. These guys are tiny. 